Hello everyone, it's the Wacky Time. Hello. Everybody has been going through phones these days, left, right and centre, and so have I. Can't, um, deny that. But anyway, these, uh, I'm going to be, this is like, this video is a part one. The next Fortnite video is part two of this video, which is going to be just five thoughts or five things that I miss about uh, this one's going to be iPhone or whatever, and the next one is going to be what I like about what I like about iPhones, iPads, iPods, whatever, and then the next video is going to be by. And what I like about Android phones, and why I can probably say what I miss. So, anyway, let's begin. Number one for iPhones, what I really liked is, um, I only had like an iPhone 4S to a straight to an iPhone 5S, so I don't know much, but I really like the, um, with the iPhone 4 and iPhone 5 is um, the build quality sort of thing. Yeah, I'm not really good at explaining things, so. I like the um, mirror back. It's just the fingerprints annoyed me. Once they swapped it to the iPhone 5S, it was like really sturdy. It felt good. I kinda had a, I kinda had a liking to small phones, not compensating for anything. <laughs> Because I like it fitting in my hand, put straight in my pocket, doesn't like take up much space in my pocket so I can put other things in. And I really have like a sensing of liking pockets a lot. So, what basically of how it felt, the material, yeah. And it just felt a bit quality. But, oh yeah, also just warning with the Android phones, they're the Android phones of my past, not the current one. But I will elaborate that in a bit. So, Number two of iPhones is the, um... <coughs> of how, um... That, I lost train of thought. Number two has to be the operating system. It, like... Frequently updates, all the app data updates very well, instead of like, with old Android phones, you had to go through and like, specifically position the apps. I like how it just installs, pops up, you put it anywhere you want, that's it. And of how you can like, fix certain things, like, restarting easily, button blah 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 so and um how it was like freaking it kept on up like easy to update also uh it was like easy to back up your phone because everything just stores on iCloud because blah 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 iCloud blah 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 even though it's kind of crappier sometimes so yeah iCloud was really good iTunes was kind of annoying, but I like the feature where you can have like a CD and it like just copies all the music with that operating system thing. It, it just made it like very simple, but yet there's a lot more, much more that can be done with it. Saying it, yeah. So, number three. Sorry, get your nose. Um. With all the, with me, like, really taking care of my phones, mine never broke, because it was, like, in a protective case, and it was easy to find a case. Either protective, non-protective, ones that were protective, but also looked good at the same time. And it was, like, really easy to find a case. I had this very, like, very good impact case where even though I took care of my phone with a protective case over it, I didn't actually, like, care that much for it if, if it broke because it was 
to me it was just a phone. I mean, oh no, my phone cracked. Oh no, I gotta pay for it. Oh no. It was easy to pay for it. <laughs> anyway, it was easy to fix it as well. Because you can probably, like, try and fix it yourself if you, like, have the tools for it or know a little bit about it if you, like, take one apart or something. I kept on dropping it. Never cracked. Unless it was, like, one time it was, like, out of the case. It cracked and it was, like... I picked it up and go... Finally! I cracked it! Because I never really cared about my iPhone. It was just, like, really annoying how, like, I kept on banging it, like, saying, well, okay, it didn't crack. I had a protective... Had it with... Sometimes I bang it without the protective case and there's, like, some little dints on the side. But... That's it. It was just weird. And, um... It was just, like... I kind of, like, get annoyed at people. And since of how the form... As I said, the form factor was, it was like a little brick. I kept on... Like, if someone, like, really annoyed me, I just, like... If I'm, like, too tired to be bothered, I just go... Tap them on the head with my iPhone and then go... Shut up. It was just really funny and really, it was like, it was kind of understanding at the time, but iPhones are not bricks. <laughs> After you break it, <laughs> definitely not. But I would probably get an iPhone again to just have a spare, just have it as a spare from this. <laughs> it betrayed iPhone. I don't care. I don't care, that symbolizes me, especially with the case. <laughs> so, yeah, that's number three. Number four has to be that, um, uh, the battery. I kind of liked of how long it was. It's just once you use, like, data or intensive things, like games and all that, <laughs> it drained really easily. So basically just five, just, this video is just five things I probably like, like three things I like, two things I dislike. It's just people fight. I didn't like how the battery was like really going, draining very quickly, but it was, I kind of also like, just a little fun fact. I liked it because it, was, I, it mostly was my video editing tool. Uh, uh, shh. But yeah, <laughs> so I didn't like how the battery, like, during a day, I can, like, it was like, I play one game, like, from home from uni, and it's like, say, 60%, and then it's like, half of that once I got home, and it was like, I didn't actually like how it charged as well, as, yeah, but that'll be... The next one so now the last little dislike i didn't like was how the phone had to stay on when it was charging i didn't like it staying on because it's like like f stuffs up the battery a lot it gets annoying with how i get like notifications once it's like connected to the internet and i don't have it like on airplane mode of what i've been hearing that could be false like, it charges faster on airplane mode. Um, I, I also didn't like it didn't have, like, SD card slot to have, like, extra storage or use that SD card as a backup. So, that's possibly the little things that I didn't mind when I had it. But it once I first transferred and it, I had, like, little storage on my first iPhone, it was, like, really, like frustrating annoying once i got through after a year or two after it, it was like really slow in responding with the screen and it freezes a lot mostly because of certain qualities of the, on the components of the phone it was and also it was just like really annoying of how the storage you had to keep that storage or just and you have to like manage it very sorry, very well, so you can have more storage or just don't take pictures or videos, and that was hard, even though I started this after when I had an iPhone 5. Yeah. 
it was really hard to like at least do anything with it since I started off with only 8 gigabytes and that was like not enough for me so bleh. thank you now this is the end of the video thank you for watching hope you watch it to this end part the next video is like far three likes or four likes and then a few dislikes I'll probably make add some of the iPhone dislikes that I l onto that one so hope you enjoy this video and soon enough I'll be going to the Royal Mail on the show because why not I need some fun yay and also soon I'll be trying to get a PlayStation 4 to get some GTA videos because I got a lot of friends on GTA on that. I'll probably get for PC as well just to like do my own thing on the PC version. So future videos coming up for you guys and hopefully you enjoy and I don't care if you like or dislike or if you want to subscribe to check how I'm trying to get video tools coming down the line for video editing and all that so I can at least like learn for the tools like instead of just using an iPad or a phone or something and like actually do some c c cool transition sort of things and, do 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 and add some good cool music and all that so hopefully you just find this video entertaining and if you have like iPhone things that you liked or disliked, let's start a conversation with us and see where it goes, okay? So I hope you enjoyed. Hope it was entertaining. Bye.